All right, so we're going to start with the home screen uh, in Apex settings. So go to Apex settings, go home screen settings, make sure both of these grids are set to 10 by 10, and both of the horizontal margins, you want those 10 by 10 as well. Infinite scrolling, none. Um, show indicator off. Now go to dock settings, go all the way to bottom, make sure hide dock is set on because we don't want the dock in there. Go to behavior settings, go down to swipe up and set show app drawer. Um, now go to advanced settings, go down, make sure resize any widget is on and overlapping widgets is also on. All right, now for the wallpaper. You're gonna to wanna to hold it down, wallpapers, live wallpapers. Go to multi-picture live wallpaper. Settings, uh, you're gonna to wanna to put in five screens here. You add in screens right here. Uh, go screen one settings, picture source, single picture. Go to your explorer and then go to um, the DF phone theme folder that I included. Uh, you should have that copy to your phone. Backgrounds, and then you want to set the first one to home. And then you want to do the same thing for all the different screens, setting each of the images uh, to their uh, same number. Now you want to go down to transition type and set that to crossfade and then go down to show reflection and turn bolt make sure both of these are off. And then you hit set wallpaper and now we have each wallpaper has a different tint to it and then favorite screen has these icons on it. All right, now you want to um, you want to swipe up now to get to your app drawer and go to UCCW. Get, hit the menu button, go to open import manage screens, do import screens, and then um, go into your file explorer, go to the DF phone theme again, UCCW, sidebar, use zip. Now you want to have that, now that that's in your phone, now you ba go back to the home screen, hold it down, add widgets, go down to UCCW doesn't matter which one of these you select because it's a set template hit sidebar it's gonna ask you to touch there to do it resize and you want to put this it's all the way to this side and it just lines up perfectly with your sidebar and you want to do the same thing for all five of the screens All right, so now you have all five of these screens with the toolbar on there, and these uh, five different buttons work. That goes to Google Drive. Um, I included the PSD in the folder so that if you don't want it to go to Reddit or Drive or the different things here, um, you can change that uh, pretty easily. Also, if you click on the clock, it goes to your uh, main clock application. Um, you have your calls, notifications down there, uh, messages, and battery percentage. All right. So for the phone screen, what I have um, is I have this widget called Simple Dialer Widget. Uh, it's pretty nice, really customizable. You can change the colors and everything, but I'm just going to leave it default for now. So then you have your dialer there, contacts, different things like that. Uh, for the music page, go into widgets. Um, you can use your music app of choice, obviously, but I use Power Amp. For your weather widget, I may or I use B Weather Pro. Um, you're gonna want to do a four by three uh, widget type you want. Current weather with forecast is what I have. Um, you may have to play with the clock font and stuff and the different font sizes to make it fit.
and then you can resize it not there and you can resize it into fitting right into this space and it looks really nice all right and for the final screen you're going to want to use desktop visualizer so go into widgets scroll down back up desktop visualizer uh, one by one usually will work for all of these uh, this one you're going to want to line up here and you want to resize it just to fit with this button same thing for all of these Now you want to go into each of these settings, click on it. Uh, for launch, you want to for the top one, you just want to set it to whatever it is. This one is store. And then for the icon, you want to go in. You want to go into your uh, explorer again. Go to the folder I included. Uh, go to other and then it's this blank PNG because that way it doesn't show anything. You want to clear the label uh, so it doesn't show any text there. In touch effect you want it none. And then you just want to do that for all these different ones, same settings. All right, and then now you have these different things. They open up to your different applications, settings. That's settings, maps, camera, Reddit, and Google Play. Um, so now that's all set. And that's how you install this theme.